right? Uh, yes, sir. Lowndes County Sheriff's staff has been working with staff on issues that Pod A has been having with the roof and the showers. The roof is leaking, causing some structural issues, and the plumbing for the showers that is in the slab and walls have eroded away, causing leaks that are uncontrollable. Staff called IPG Incorporated to come in and evaluate the issue since we were dealing with an emergency situation and IPG assisted in the design of the building when the building was built in 1991. IPG and their consulting engineers have visited the site several times and have come up with the best possible solution for a new roof and rebuilding the showers. IPG has submitted a proposal for the design, bidding, and construction administration for the project. If approved, IPG and staff plan to bid the new roof and shower rebuild separately. The new roof design can be ready to advertise for bid within two weeks, and the shower rebuild design can be ready to advertise for bid within four weeks. The funds for this project will come from SPLOS 6 money that was returned from Peter Brown Construction on the savings from the construction management at risk project of building pods C and D during construction of phase two completed in 2009. Do you have any questions for Mr. McClellan? Yes, Mr. Chairman, I wanted to know approximately how much was returned uh, uh, from the construction company. Uh, back in 2009, we had approximately $1 million returned. $1 million. Mm -hmm. Okay. I was just asking the question because I know, if, say, if the, the bid come back, that, you know, I don't want it to exceed what we already... We, we estimated the project to end up costing around $450,000 for the uh, roof and the shower rebuild. And board. this is the old jail, right? That is correct. That is pods A and B, the old housing pods. It was built in 1991. So now the, the objective now is to, to get the old jail back functioning versus doing what? That's correct. Any other questions? Okay. Thank you, Mr. Clyde.